Hey, y'all. Okay, I cannot begin to explain just how much fun I'm having right now. Um, you know, I've, I've done this, my Bible, so that I'm able to have room to be creative on it. And I just wanted to show you something that I'm. some of you may not be aware of if you're really new to Zoom Notes. There's a couple of ways to do text. If you look over on the left, I, I decided to do um, do a legend. So <laughs> I actually know what these pictures mean, you know, five years from now. You know, if I, I, the whole point of the picture is so that I can quickly see that this is who's talking over on the left. And, um, you know, they I'll start to kind of, well, I'm not sure if that's a preacher or if that, you know. And all I have to do is look on the text. Hello. But... Um, you know, just for more fun, something else to do. I want to show you two different ways of putting text over on the left. Um, if, if and when you have time to do things. All right. First of all, if you don't have time and you're in a hurry, you know, you just handwrite it. That's the fastest to me in my mind. And that's what I did down at the bottom where it says Peter's mother-in-law. Now, so that I didn't have to write real, real tiny, I, I um, wrote it bigger down below. So now I can select it and make it smaller so that it fits underneath. Well, heck, I do that a lot. Okay, so, so that it fits underneath Peter. Let me go ahead and erase this one. Okay. Now, this to me is magic. This was one of those things that we got after we were able to pull in um, CSV files. Uh, Ed saw, it's like, oh, well, I need to do that. <laughs> You know, it's like, oh my gosh, and it's magic, and I know that this is not what he intended it for, but this is how I use it. Um, whenever I do hand handwriting, that's the fast way, and then I end up, I don't love my handwriting, especially on the slippery glass, so what I do when I have time later is to take a table, I've, I've got a table selected, um, if you look down on the bottom, the grayed out table, that is a table that has no outline. See, you can't see it, but there is a table there. So now what I do is I select both the table and the text. And if you look down, see I'm moving my uh, selection toolbar on the far right. There's a grid with ABC in it. That, I think, let me see what he calls it here on, the, on this. Um, insert table text. There it is under table. Insert table text. So if I, if I click on that right now. <laughs> okay, it just changed the text into... Um, uh, no, it changed the handwriting into text. Now, I'm noticing that it, I, I must have messed up and put the L behind the A. So now I'll just click on the, the A. And, you know, now it's just text, so I can do what I want to with it. Go back over here and type in L. This just happens to be the font that I'm using. I, I like that font. And I can get rid of that. And I really want mother-in-law to be on the same row. And I also want it to be centered. If I go to um, go to tap on that and get the menu for the text tool, and then I go to the bottom of customize and turn on more settings. Now I've got a format and I want to change that to center so that now Peter's kind of centered to mother-in-law. 
and I want to change the line spacing slightly so that mother-in-law is a little bit closer. Isn't that cool? God, I love Zoom notes. Now, that's one way of doing it. And that's the way I did it initially was um, I hand wrote it and then did that each and every time. I had a one-cell table that in that particular case, so I didn't have to deal with filling and out and borders and such, I went ahead and made a favorite that had no outline and it was just a one cell, no columns, no rows, just one, one and one. Okay. But on these particular, the ones up above, I came back and I did it this way. If I, um, click on the, well, let me go here. The A with the I-beam. Where is it? A with the I-beam. I have it on my toolbar. Okay, under Selection Tools. The second one from the right, Select PDF Text. I use that a lot too, especially with this. So if I choose that... Well, I may have... I think I've locked my machine up. Okay, there it goes. And I select... Let me do it this way, because I... I think my machine is suddenly running on very slow motion. I've done something. I guarantee you that if I look here, I've got like all kinds of windows open. So this is what I'll try to do is close some stuff down when I start having slowdowns on my machine. And let's see. I've, I've only got three things, but, you know, this particular book is 1,800 pages. So let me try it again. Oh, God. And then the next thing I test is, is my pencil charged? And it's not. Hello. That's okay. Y'all needed to see that anyway. So I choose the A with the I down on the left. See, I just tapped it with my finger. And I go here and tap there and drag it over to father-in-law. It's harder to do when you're using your finger. Ugh. No, teacher of the law. That's what that is. Teacher of the law. Oh, God. Okay, there. And do copy. And then double tap to paste it. No. See, there it is up at the top. You can't see it. Select it. Right here. <laughs> Maybe I can't select it with my finger. Golly. Oh, let's see. See, here it is. And again, that's text. So if I change it to the A and I do this, see, then I can make it the way it I want it to be. And again, I can change it to centered, more settings, customize, um, uh, format, I mean, and do center and take in the line so they're a little closer together. And that's how you do that, okay? I am having so much fun, y'all. Okay, I, I, I might as well go ahead and admit it here. I, don't, I hate reading. I, I hate reading. I don't read. And, you know, that's kind of what I need to do. Being a Christian, I need to read my Bible. And this has changed my life. Now I, I wake up in the morning, I, I jump up and I start playing with this, okay? And if you spend this much time working on it, you're getting, you know, you're reading. And you're kind of meditating on what you're drawing. Because it's like, well, how would, I, how would I make that look if I was drawing it? So, that and anyway, I'm having so much fun. Okay, you guys have a great day here. Bye.